In Unit 5, Chapter 2, Section 2, we're going to cover how to start and open a Factory Tuck View ME. Factory Tuck View ME is the runtime environment for the HMI, so it provides the panel interface that the user or operator will see when navigating the system. So, to open up Factory Tuck View ME, we can open by clicking this orb that's down here to the left of Studio 5000. And now we need to open a project. I will just go ahead and open the Controls Lab project. And that will show us the interface for the Controls Lab HMI, the part that you see that comes up on the main screen when the system boots. So Factory Tuck is loading on the left hand side here. Um, we can see the status of Factory Tuck itself down below. What things are loading and what's up and running and ready to go. What connections are being made. We also have a similar explorer to Studio 5000 where everything is navigated and manipulated from the left hand side of the screen here. I'm going to open up just one of the displays for Controls Lab. So here's the main screen that shows up on the system. So this is the background or the HMI panel programming that allows the user to interact with the PAC programming that we did before. So Factory Talk View basically just allows us to create the graphical interface, the part that looks good on the screen when the user is navigating and running the HMI. So we can navigate through the displays under this graphics tab. We also have global objects like our analog input modules that we will use in the programming have these types of interfaces that we can use. All of this is stuff that comes with the plant PAX library. So these are all imports that we use along with the add-on instructions to create that graphical user interface that Controls Lab has. We can run the application or run what we have made and configured in this window by clicking this test application button. So that will run a one-time runtime to test and see if you have connections made properly and see if everything works. Um, once we're on a display, I'm going to go back to that main display. We have, if we click into it, we can see all, all these options are now accessible where we can um, add a string, add, add text somewhere on the screen if need be. Um, and basically manipulate and control all of the features that come along with Factory Talk Studio. So that is the basic interface for Factory Tuck View Studio. Again, it's got the file menu that we're used to seeing with all the options that we just talked about and more. When we are done, we can close our displays by cl clicking the X in the corner. I don't want to save the changes because I didn't do anything to it. So I'm just going to hit no.